Bookmaker Company. This is KTN News. Good morning and welcome to KTN News Center. We bring you up to date with what is making the headlines. My name is Brenda Zadaradido. Welcome to the program. And let's begin from the coast with some breaking news. And a building under construction has collapsed in Malinde, trapping an unknown number of people who are living in the lower floors. Now seven people, among them four women and a child, have already been rescued from the debris. The building fell on nearby residential houses and a petrol station. Francis Mtelake is covering that for us and now joins us live. Mtelake, thank you so much for joining us. And uh, we shall be speaking to Mtelake shortly about the latest details that we're getting right here on New Center. It is that her building has collapsed in uh, Malinde. And uh, so far, what we know that it is an eight-story building under construction at Barini Malinde. It collapsed at dawn on Friday. And the building, we understand, housed people in its lower floors, and it fell on adjust adjacent residential houses and a petrol station. However, it is unclear what, the, what caused the building to collapse, uh, seeing as heavy rains have pounded the region and caused floods. And what we know so far, it is that disaster management units are on location, uh, saying there are a known number of people trapped under the rebels. And of course, we have Francis Mtelaki right there, still trying to get a hold of him so that he can bring us up to date with what is happening. And uh, I understand that we have a reporter, Francis Mtelaki. Mtelaki, good morning. What, what is the latest, the latest information that you have for us uh, this morning concerning that building that has collapsed in the coast region? Well, the latest uh, that we have uh, from Malindi in Kilifi County is that uh, uh, the building uh, collapsed early morning and it was under uh, construction. And uh, <coughs> we've been able to speak to the county uh, police boss, who is Bana Frederick Ocheng. He says that uh, the rescue uh, is underway, but uh, so far he confirmed that one person has been confirmed dead and uh, seven others have been rescued. Uh, and uh, uh, among those seven is... Uh, Four of them are women and a child uh, have already been rescued. But also he said that uh, the, the rescuers uh, are still searching for two more people that uh, they are believed to be, uh, be trapped in that building. And uh, the, 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 the voices can, can be heard for them calling for, uh, for help. And uh, maybe to give you uh, some, of the, uh, some of the background with regard to what has hap been happening, the area is said to be uh, in, in within the, 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 the Malindi town. And uh, the building fell on uh, nearby some uh, three residential houses and uh, a petrol station that uh, is, is uh, <coughs> around the, the area of where the building fell and this is uh, an eighth uh, story building it was going to be one of the uh, tallest building in malindi and in fact uh, uh, it was under still under construction but uh, the lower the lower floors were occupied that is what we have uh, from malindi and uh, many are saying that it is because of the heavy rains that have been uh, in part, uh, have been raining in many parts of the uh, coast region and specifically the five counties that uh, the meteorological department said that uh, will be experiencing heavy rains including mombasa uh, lamu Kwale, Kilifi, and Tana River. Brenda. And Talaki, this case is of building collapsing. Is this the one in coast is not the first, neither probably might it be the last. If you have any details when it comes to that building, was it earmarked for demolition? Was it approved by the county government? 
so far, what we understand that the building was still under construction, and uh, that tells you maybe the, the county government of uh, Kilifi could have approved that. We are yet to confirm from the authorities from the county government of Kilifi. But uh, what we can be able to say and confirm currently is that uh, the building was still under the under, under construction, and the lower floors were occupied, and also uh, some of the uh, residential uh, uh, houses that were within that area uh, were also occupied. And so this tells uh, the, the challenge that uh, the rescuers are having in terms of making sure that uh, they are being able to help the, uh, those who have been trapped in that, uh, in that building. And also it had affected some other three buildings. And so uh, how many people have been, uh, have, been, uh, have been trapped? We are yet to understand that. And so we are also keeping an eye on what is happening in Kilifi and Malindi town specifically with regard to the building that collapsed early morning. Brenda. All right, thank you so much, Francis Mitalaki. Right now, I'd like us to talk to the Red Cross Regional uh, Manager of in Malindi, that is Hassan Juma, is joining us by way of phone to also tell us so far how the rescue mission is ongoing.